Hey guys, welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews. Thanks for joining me once again, and I hope everyone has been enjoying their day thus far. In today's show, I have three watch faces to show you from our friends at Bajork, and the designs today should appeal to a larger group of people out there because I have both formal and casual designs to show you, and in analog, hybrid, and all digital versions, so really there is something for everyone's taste here. Plus, I'm going to be giving away 10 coupon codes for one of these faces, your choice, in our giveaway contest, so make sure you leave a comment below for a chance to win one of these coupons. Okay, let's go have a closer look at these very different designs from Bajork. Okay guys, starting things off, here's a very luxurious and traditional looking watch face that's set in this extremely minimalist style as you only have the current date displayed and that's in that small square frame on the right hand side. Now besides looking very elegant, I think this one also has an old world style to it because you have those Roman numerals around the bezel for the hour digits and the backgrounds have a subtle yet classy look and texture to them and the shading is also very nice on these. Now this one comes preloaded with seven different background themes which gives you a chance to match the variations to a specific colored watch strap for example or perhaps you want to match it to a color or colors in a tie that you're wearing. Whatever the case is you can keep the background simple looking or very vibrant. Plus, this model also has gyro lighting effects built in, which shift on the display when you move the watch back and forth. And lastly, this one comes preloaded with a lovely blue loom AOD mode. Okay guys, next up is this hybrid watch face, which has a very sporty look to it, and I love those pointy arrow-like hands for the analog time. Now this one also has some hide or reveal functionality built in, whereby when you double tap on the right hand side, it switches between the logo panel and the digital time. And the time here can also be shown in a 12 or 24 hour format. And just remember that to set that, you actually assign it on your smartphone and then the settings are automatically synced to your watch. So you effectively have the choice of either keeping this an all analog and sporty looking face or you can add the digital time into the mix if you want and add an extra level of casualness to it. Now features for this one include the date above the digital time and your total step count is underneath it. The rest of your information is spread out in those three dials with your power remaining in the top dial, your steps goal progress is to the left and in the bottom is your last recorded heart rate. And lastly, this one comes with a clean and colorful AOD mode. Okay, and the last one that I wanted to share with you guys is this very sporty looking all digital watch face, which is also very easy to read because of those large and bold digits for the time there located right in the center of the face. And although you can't change the backgrounds on this one, it still does come with a very sporty and attractive carbon fiber theme, and it looks really nice with this design and layout. And besides being a great looking casual face, this one would also be good for fitness lovers because you have a variety of activity information on the display. And again, it's easy to see that information because of the bright colored digits against that darker background. Now in the bottom half of the face, you have your power remaining, your distance moved, your calories burnt, as well as your last recorded heart rate. In the top half of the face and just above that time, is your daily step goal progress, some app shortcuts, as well as your total steps count. And in total, there's actually five app shortcuts on this face, with the two that I mentioned assigned to your alarm and timer, and the remaining three shortcuts open your stopwatch, your calendar, and S Health apps. And if you want more information on the watch face that I reviewed today, then simply do a search in the Galaxy App Store under the name of this face. The full details, including the direct link, is included right in the video description. And I'm also going to be giving away free coupons to random and lucky viewers that comment below. I'm going to leave a reply under the winner's comments to let them know exactly how they can get a coupon. As always, good luck to everyone, enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. 
Thanks again for watching our review and if you liked it then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and share the video with your friends because with your support it really helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways and of course fresh content. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.